Welcome, and um, this time we're going to talk about um, 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 broadcast um, 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 intents. So what is this broadcast intent? So inside one um, activity, let's say, and you're going to have a button. Okay, it's the same concept as the previous one, which is implicit intent. So um, this one we're going to be able to... Um, this one we're going to be able to... Um, um, we're gonna be able to, um, let's say, have a button with send broadcast. Okay. When you click on send broadcast, it's going to um, send our an intent. It's going to send our an intent. Okay. It's going to send our an intent. This one. Intent. Okay. And for this intent, you're gonna be able to specify an accent. Okay. Using an um, accent string, okay. accent it is a string. Okay, you'll be able to specify an accent, and this accent going to be broadcast. Okay, this accent going to be broadcast out, sent out. Okay, this accent going to be broadcast out, and on our device, on our device. Okay, on our device. on our device uh, there are some um, um, packages or activity and um, um, in the packages and activity they gonna declare they gonna declare they gonna declare intent filter also based on the concepts which is they gonna declare the intent filter with the same accent strings okay intent intent filter with the same accent string okay, with the accent string corresponding corresponding accent string okay corresponding intent filter with the corresponding accent string and if this accent string and this accent string are matches okay if this accent string and this accent string are matches okay um, this um, not activity not activity this receiver this one is called a receiver okay and this one is a receiver and you may have um, many receivers inside the device because okay, it's another um, receiver um, 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 if the receiver also declared the same okay, the same what is called intent filter okay, intense filter with the same accent strength okay this one if this one is matches Okay, with um, um, this accent string, if this accent string, this accent string matches with this accent string, this one will be um, called, okay, and this receiver will be activated, this receiver will be activated, once it is activated, it's going to call to the method, which is on receipt, on receipt method, okay, on receipt method, it's going to call to the on receipt method of this, okay, it's going to call to on receipt method of this and when you call to on receipt method of this you can do anything you can write code to do anything that you want you can write code to do anything that you want over here okay mm, and the receiver is not an activity okay it is just a receiver of this broadcast and both of these will be activated both of these will be executed and not like not like the one from not like the one from um, um, implicit intent so if implicit intents, um, if there are more than one activity which is matches with the accent string, the device is going to prompt you, okay, for you to choose the first one or the second one, okay. And um, in this case, for um, broadcast, it's gonna, just gonna broadcast to everyone, and everyone is just gonna call to the on receipt method of its own and write its own process, okay. It's not prompting and it's not um, for user to choose one, okay. So. Let's, let's just go to the application. Okay, we're going to start a new Android application. In this application, we're going to name um, Broadcast Sender. Okay, broadcast Sender. Next. Next. Um, we'll have a blank activity. Next. Um, this main activity. Okay. Finish. Now I'm gonna delete this one and we're gonna collapse this, collapse this. Um, um, I'm gonna drag and drop in a button. 
and this one we're gonna change it to sun broadcast this one is button sun broadcast in order to send broadcast we're gonna make a meeting public void um, on button send broadcast click view okay. view space view enter okay this one we're going to do um, Control space, so control space. Okay. Um, now, um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna um, create an intense, intense. Okay, intense equal to new. And when we create this intense, we only specify the accent. Okay, we're going to specify the accent. And this time, I'm going to demonstrate about um, creating um, um, custom accent, so we can specify our own accent. And this time, I'm gonna use this accent. This um our package name. Normally, the pack uh, the accent that we specify is supposed to be unique for us. Okay, even it's custom accent, so it should be um unique. So normally, it is specified in form of the um, um URI. So I'm specifying this form. Okay, so now um we're going to um, um take this dot send broadcast. Okay. This one is intense. Um, there is one extra notice. Okay, so after um, Android three point three point zero, if you broadcast this intense and um, the um, receiver which is in the stop state, it will not be able to um, execute our application. So um, 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 we need to um, um, add a flag into this one to show that even the stop package is going to be able to um, um, react to this or going to be um, take effects from this intense as well so you need to specify intense dot um, um, add flex and this one we're going to say intense dot flag um, include the include the stop packages too okay include the stop packages too okay include the stop package too yeah. Then now, uh, then now, uh, with these three lines of code, we'll be able to send out the broadcast with this accent string. So it's it's gonna, it's gonna if you get back to this one, it's gonna be able to send out the intent or as a broadcast message. It's gonna broadcast outside with this accent string. Then, um, then we need to wire this method to the button. So click back on the co I just copy the uh, method name already. Okay. Click on this button, click on this component tree, click on this title, now type on click, click on the on click, click on this one, paste it, press enter, click on this one again, make sure it's already selected. Okay. So if you send this one, it's gonna broadcast a message outside. It's gonna broadcast a message outside. So now I'm going when it's broadcast a message outside, I'm going to create another application. Okay, I'm gonna create another application. This one is another application with the receiver to react to um, this intent. So um, we're gonna click on fire new project. Okay, and I'm, I'm gonna name this one is called the um, broadcast receiver. Receiver. Okay. Right, next. Um, and this one, um, a broadcast receiver, is not an activity, so I don't add any activity to this one. So I'm just gonna click on no activity. Okay, click on finish. And then for this, I'm gonna click on pause. Okay, from this app, from Java, from our package, I'm gonna right click on this and click on new. Um, um, you can create a new um, um, Java class then um, extends from receiver or you can uh, choose other um, then you're gonna choose broadcast receiver here okay. and then um, we are name it broadcast receiver this exported means it's a public means it can be accessed by other packages and this enable means it is active it's not visible so we'll make sure that both of them are selected so we'll click on finish and um, this one is our receiver. Okay, um, when it's um, um, this one, 
um, it, it's it's going to extend from a broadcast receiver when it it, it receives the intense message it's going to call to the on receive method and um, when it um, receives this one it pass you the context of this package and also it pass you the intent activated or uh, or the um, um, intent activated to the receiver or the broadcast intent then right now we are going to um, let's say um, those a message okay, with the string accent with the string accent okay with the string accent over here so um, um, we gonna be able to um, access the string accent accent equal to intense dot uh, get accent okay and then I'm going to close a message what is a toast message? Toast message is a quick flash. It's gonna flash on the screen for you to show the message. So in order to toast, it's gonna say toast dot make text. Uh, the context is this context. Uh, pass in first to use the context. And then the um, um, character sequence. So this sequence is gonna be um, detected, and we're gonna place the accent over there. And then we are able to specify another. Um, information for this toast message, which is um, the um, duration of the toast and um, toast dot. Okay, it's maybe length long or short. So the time the flash showing is gonna be long or short correspondingly before it fades out. I'm gonna choose long so that we'll see. Okay, then remember to show this one, otherwise it's not gonna work. Okay, otherwise it's not gonna work. Okay, then um, next kind of thing that you need to see is. Um, we need to declare the intense filter. We need to declare the intense filter. Okay. We need to declare the intense filter. Okay. For the, this receiver, so that it can react to this kind of accent string. So we're going to um, go to project, go to manifest. Double click on it and see it's already declared our. It's already declares our intense filters. Okay, which is with the name, it's enabled, it, it, it's exported. Now we're going to specify now intense filter now. And this one we're going to specify the accent it can react to, which is um, 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 the names. And the name must be the same as the um, custom name that we specify over here, which is this package. So I'm going to copy this one of the sender. Then we're going to paste it here. Now it's a good point for us to it's a good point for us to um, um, click on run this one, and um, you see the red cross here, which is because that we don't have any activity, so we select don't launch any activity to install. So if you click on run, it's going to install the app to the simulator. Okay, use the same device next time. the same device next time okay it's, it's already installed so if you click on run it's already installed successfully then we get back to our application um, um, I, I think I click on something just under this one. what is that I just click on something okay yeah okay um, then we're gonna get back on this one. If we cl click on this one to send out the broadcast message, okay, click on this one to send out the broadcast message. So use the same device next time. Click on OK. So um, now, uh, like this, if you click on this one, it's create an intent with the accent string and send it as a broadcast outside. And the receiver now is gonna be able to react to it. By using its um, um, intent filter with the same accent string, it's going to on receipt message. On receipt message, it's going to toast the message for us to see. So um, we're gonna get to this one. If you click send, see it detected this accent, detected this accent. So this one is about um, um, broadcast um, sender and um, implicit intent um, receiver. Okay. You are also able to um, receive the um, um, accent from a uh, rhythm system, but that one I'm going to do in um, the next video. Okay.